Now and then I let it go I ride the waves I can't control I'm learning how to build a better boat Hi, I'm Jack. And I'm Ryan. We are sixth grade students from Central Massachusetts. Today we are going to build an elastic powered paddle boat. Our goal for this project is to carry a ping pong ball across 30 inches of water. Engineering design we are going to solve is to make a powered boat that will move a ping pong ball across 30 inches of water. Our original plan was to make a boat out of balsa wood, but since it was too light we used pine wood. Our solution was to use thicker wood, so we used pine. We plan on solving the problem to move a ping pong ball across 30 inches of water by making a rubber band powered boat. The boat will move by a rubber band powered wooden paddle. This should be able to move a ping pong ball across 30 inches of water. We found a boat on youtube.com with the shape frame we wanted. This is the machine we built to carry a ping pong ball across 30 inches of water. We decided to make our boat a half inch wider on both sides. I'm cutting out the plan to trace it onto the wood. I'm chasing the plan on the wood. I'm cutting out the hole for the rudder. We are sanding the parts to our boat. I had my grandfather cut the grooves in the propeller pieces and this is how they fit together. So right now I'm putting the glue onto the propeller. We made a decoration for a little cabin so I'm gluing it together. We decided to polyurethane it to make it waterproof. I am gluing a decoration onto our boat. Right now I'm putting the elastic band on for our propeller. Right now I'm putting the propeller onto our boat. Right now I'm gluing this together to make a box to hold the ping pong ball.
is the 30 inch mark. I wound it 15 times, so now we're going to see if it goes. The boat carried the ball 30 inches in the water when we tested it. The difficult aspect we encountered was during the first test we did with the boat went off to the side and the propeller hit the boat. At first the boat went crooked so we're adding rudders to make the boat go straight. For our modifications we added the washers to make this the propeller not hit and then we also made rudders to make the boat go straight and not crooked. This is our final test with all the modifications. The modifications worked well. Doing the washers, we had to try several different sizes and amounts because the propeller was getting caught if the washers made it too tight. In conclusion, building this boat was easy. We felt it works good and succeeded in moving the ball 30 inches across the water. It was fun working together, but it was hard getting together with soccer, football, wrestling, and being in the play. Thank, Thank you for watching, watching our video. video.